सो हाई एवरी वन रिसेंटली लैंग चीन हैज ब्रॉट इन सम बिग चेंजेस इन दियर होल स्ट्रक्चर दैट इज दे हैव ब्रॉट इन अ न्यू कॉन्सेप्ट कॉल्ड इज लैंग चेन एक्सप्रेशन लैंग्वेज सो वॉट इट इज हाउ इट इज यूज टूडे विल बी डिस्कसिंग दैट एंड एंड देन आई विल बी शोइंग यू फ्यू डेमोन्स्ट्रेशन सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो इन द फर्स्ट केस वॉट इज एल सी एल सो एल सी एल कैन बी टेकन एज अ लैंग्वेज विच हेल्प्स यू टू बिल्ड आउट चेन ऑब्जेक्ट्स very easily so rather than calling out some um, inbuilt function passing parameters you just need to mention what components you want and eventually using a pipe you can line them to form a chain so let's see an example here uh here i'm using a chat prompt template for now what is so this is a prompt that i'm using what is a city person is a variable that i'm passing is from translate sentence into the city native language right so here i'm trying to pass out two variables then i am creating a model object using the chat open ai and the third part is how i am lining up chaining up the components prompt model and string output parser right so basically in previous case uh, in previous examples that i demonstrated you must have seen that uh, first of all i am creating a prompt then while creating the llm uh, then i create an lm object then i call a lm chain object when which i pass the llm and the prompt so it was a lot of code here they have made things a little easier now you create your components uh, separately and for chaining purpose just use a pipe that's it no codes required so this will help you create a custom chain very easily now the chain is created and once you invoke person virat kohli sentence how are you virat kohli is from delhi delhi Uh, in india to translate how are you in native language of delhi which is hindi today tum kaise ho so here you can see that it is able to use the prompt that i provided the model and the string output parser it's very easy to create and creating custom chains now becomes very very easy uh, now moving on to a more complex example to make uh, understand how complex things can also be made very easy with lcl so here what i am doing i will be chaining out two chains two existing chains in which the second chain will be taking an input from the first chain so that's the most interesting part so let's see so here i am creating two prompts which country won the game world cup so i will be mentioning which game football cricket this is a variable so this is the best entity from the country now what i am doing is uh, i am passing three variables in which game and entity would be passed by the user but country would be taken from the answer of the first chain so this is very interesting so which are, like for example if i give it like cricket world cup so australia won the recent world cup so this becomes such as the best entity from australia entity would be the variable that i'm passing so this will show you how you can create more complex custom chains using lcl very very easy so chain 1 is prompt 1 model string output parser prompt 1 is which country won the game world cup model and string output parser chain 2 is a little complex country colon chain 1 so country the variable that i have i'm getting it from chain 1 the answer of chain 1 right entities item getter entity right this is the variable that i'm passing but country is coming from chain 1 that i'm piping it with prompt 2 so uh, in case of chain 2 that i'm creating the first step is not the prompt but the ex but existing chain 1 chain 1 then prompt then model model i'm using the same and string output parser Now, if once I invoke the chain to game football entity is dish, but I'm not passing the country as you can see. One of the most popular iconic dish from France is cock ou win. So here you can see that once I pass football, eventually the country that won the football will come according to whatever knowledge base LM has. It was France, and automatically it has given the answer for the last chain. It is hearty and flavorful dish, etc., etc. Two things to note. we have no way written the answer for the first chain right uh, no way the lm has printed out the answer for the first chain because it was never directly called it was a part of chain 2 second thing we are very easily able to get variable from chain 1 to chain 2 now creating such a complex chain is very very difficult in the existing lm chain concept that is already existing so lcl comes with a, a breath of fresh air and eventually it helps you to more customize everything so this lcl concept can be used in most of the cases chains agents everywhere so this is a demonstration how you can create custom chains using lcl and what is lcl in general in lang chain 